Hi all and uh, welcome back to my channel and today I have an unboxing from Mutiny Made. This is my first Mutiny Made purchase. I've been trying to get one of their trays for quite a while and realized that when you ordered a kit you got a tray if you upgraded the toolkit. So I did it that way um, when this kit came back in stock. This was one that I had actually been looking at. There's another one that I'm also looking at but I need to wait a little bit. Uh, to uh, place another order. So in any case, we'll go ahead and get started. So I did take the tray out of the bubble wrap because I uh, wanted to uh, use it. So I just stuck it back in the bag. Um, but this is the Mini Maid tray uh, that I got, which may tell you what kit I got if you uh, know anything about if you are have it and know that this is a tray that comes with that kit so we have the cover we have the tray itself and then we have the stopper okay and then the other goodies we got in the bag okay. let's see let's see Let's go ahead and uh, see. So first we got this little card with the socials. We got a thank you. It says, Mary, thanks so much for ordering my small, uh, from my small business. It is my wish that your order can bring you even just the slightest bit of joy and happiness today. Enjoy your new goodies. And let's see, so we have a pair of tweezers. So this, as I mentioned earlier, is the upgraded toolkit. So we have a pair of tweezers, pink tweezers. We have, oops, the lid fell off. So we have uh, this little mermaid single placer. We have your standard uh, pen, it is blue. And it has the four placer on, and here's the seven placer. We have this cute little roll of a uh, washi. This adorable little uh, color reminder that's a rainbow. So has the magnets and so yep, it's all good. We have this which has uh, some wax on the swimming. Let's see, we have lots of wax. One, two. Looks like maybe four pla plates of wax. Let me see, three. And there is another one stuck in the bottom, so that's four. So yeah, there are four plates, five, oh, five plates of wax, because two are stuck together. So there are five plates of wax in here. And then we got this little, um, oops, about to knock you all over, sorry there. We will, uh, you back. Okay, sorry about that. And we got this cute little egg, and it has this cute little bunny thing in. And I will definitely find a place for it. So let me quickly go ahead and pick this all up. And then now we can get into this bag. So I did buy the dust cover, so I'd have something to use to store it. So it does come with this nice little loop, and it does tell you what the canvas is. So I will go ahead and show this now. So this is uh, Dia Day of Dawn by Femme K. Deborah. It is a square that is their uh, 
skew and then it's a 60 by 85. So we can start straightening it. Okay, so first off, we have this sheet of paper, and it just uh, says thank you so much for purchasing one of uh, our very first Mimi May brand diamond foot kit, uh, painting kits. And it says that they're listening to feedback. It says how to diamond paint, policies and upcoming changes. Okay, so here is their sticker sheet. So, um, there are two columns of stickers. There's one if you just want to use a symbol, which is what most people go by, or there's a set if you want um, to use, looks like both the symbol and the uh, DMC number. That's what I will use. Looks like, as you can see, they do peel off right there. Then they're individually cut, so that's good. It also gives you the start and end date. It tells you that it's a Muni May kit, the name of the painting and the artist, and it gives you the specs down here. Here are the gems. It looks like the gems also have their kit number along with the size. So that is good. So if you store the drills separately, you can. We will look at those more thoroughly in just a minute. So first we will show this canvas and let's see. We will have to go up just a little bit to continue with this. Um, okay, so here it says Muni Made over there at the top right and the this canvas the bottom left you have the legends over here you have the thumbnail of the original art along with all the specs you see that it has the copyright that's the symbol symbolizes that uh it is legally licensed and the artist is getting fairly compensated and down at the bottom there's uh some of uh it's muni made the website along with the artist and their socials. So that's a nice little uh, addition. Uh, let's see, there are 40 colors and there are two ABs. So AB stands for Aurora Boy Alice and uh, they, on this kit they are the bottom two here. Once we go through the colors, we will uh, look at the canvas and try to find the ABs. So this bag will never look the same again. I said I will not be able to put them in this bag. But that being said, let's go ahead and get into the colors. Right. 
Okay, so go ahead and start here. This one, this is one or two. Turn one. Oh, there's one. Okay, good. Had me a little worried. Okay, so let's get this party started and I will just be comparing it off of this just to make sure we have everything. Oops, let's put this around so I can read it. So this is uh, 152. Looks like we have one bag of that. And then 154. have this is really weird lighting then let me go ahead and actually lower this back down okay this is a 159 one bigger that we have 168 We have 209, we have 210, we have 223, We have 414. We have 554. And second bag of 554. Seven forty-five, seven fifty-four, seven fifty-eight, seven seventy-five, like that mint green color. A nice big bag. Uh, let's see, nine fifteen. Nine twenty eight. Another minty color. Nine thirty nine. Looks like we have two bags of 950. We have just 9.63. 30.72. Thirty-three twenty-eight. Thirty-three fifty-four. 
Then we have one, two, three. Don't do three. One, two, three. Don't do this. So we have three bags of uh, 37.13. We have 37.26. Two bags of 37.27. Thirty seven, thirty one, two bags of thirty seven, forty three, thirty seven, forty six. We have 37.47 3 bags of 37.70 37.71 37.77 37, 78, 38, 34, 38, 35, 38, 36, two bags, 38, 3855 5200 and then we have our two ABs so we have a 963 AB we have two bags of this and the special coating you can sort of see it makes it sparkle like multi different color like a rainbow of colors bags of that. And then we have one bag of uh, 5200 AB. So that was nice if I have a mix of uh, 5200 AB and 5200. So that will be nice. And there I think you can see the coating. Especially since there's multiple light sources. Natural daylight as well as overhead lighting. So yeah, that's all the colors. Let me go ahead and uh, put these all away and we will be right back. Okay, so we are going to go ahead now and attempt to find the two uh, ABs on the canvas. So they are the Y and then the triangle symbols. So first, there are some of the triangles right in through here and then here. And there's some right in through here, over here as well, and a few mixed in up here. Over here, some up over here and in here, and also over here. There's a couple right in through here. Um, then there are also some in here and in here. Uh, there's some in through here, through here, and then through here. So 
also some into here and here and here showing the tail throughout the tail some into there and here and there and then some more in through here and then through here Then there's just some through here, some up here, and then through here. Sorry. Okay, and then the Y. So the Y is the some of the pink throughout in here and here and through here throughout the throughout the tail for sure and then throughout the tail um go here else as the Y. Really? Um, no, there. I think it's just throughout the tail. And oh, oh, there's a little up here too. And so the the uh, just the dress. Um, there's some throughout here too. Yeah. So it's throughout the tail and then throughout the uh, bodice area. And then. Uh, there's also some uh, triangles up here on the forehead here, and then through um, the head piece up through here. So yeah, it looks like uh, very fair number. I really like this painting. It's just I love the rainbow and I love the cloud setting, and um, I love that it's a mermaid too. So this is super cool. Um, I wish I knew when I was getting to this, but there's so many that I want to do. This would definitely be higher up on the list than some others. Uh, I would say this maybe after the one I'm currently working on, but uh, definitely soon. I really love her and I want to get her worked up. There are several others though that I also want to get worked up, so we shall see. Um, but yeah, overall, super happy with this. The jewels look really nice. I don't see any like concave drills or anything. Uh, I love that they're squares. Love that you know they're uh, they look like decent quality. Um, won't know for sure until I start working it. But um, yeah, super happy to have this one. And with that, I will let you go. Bye. Mm -hmm.